Emma Bailey. Emma Bailey, no. Rebecca Collins. Hannah Davies. Sarah. Leanne. Zoe. No, no Zoe. Oh, just a minute. Uh, Charlotte. Alana. Alana Morgan. No. Stacy Murray. Rachel O. Can't say it. Rachel. That should do. Leanne.
just doing all that. I know. Hey, it was straight north. I know, yeah. Yeah, Hannah just said. by John Maysfield, Reynard's last run, which describes how the fox had to run for its life and put you inside the fox's mind. So you had the hunt chasing you. And it's, in fact, written at the pace of farmers, somebody who actually makes a living in the countryside who would know whether a fox would be a, a real nuisance and methods of keeping it down or not. And then for homework this week, you had to write a speech giving your opinions. And I hope you have all done that. Let me see them in front of you right now. I promised you a debate. I think it's going to be believes that fox hunting should be banned. Claire has bravely volunteered to support the leadership. Uh, welcome everybody. The motion before this house is um, we all think fox hunting should be banned. Um, this is Leanne and Hayley. Fox hunting is a horrible pastime. That's all it is. A pastime, not a sport. Who has the right to kill animals? In this case, foxes. If people say they should kill foxes because the sheep kill, because the foxes kill sheep and chickens. But we also kill sheep, chickens, and also other animals. But do giant elephants come chasing us? No. So why do we do it to foxes? I know that we kill animals for food, but so do foxes. They have to eat just like us. It's not all the foxes' fault either. If farmers lock the chickens up and also the sheep, foxes won't be able to eat them. Also, they say that hunting is to keep the number of, of foxes down. We can all understand that, but there is a way to do it. I mean, th everyone says that the foxes kill sweet. They don't kill lambs, they only kill chickens, and they only kill those if the farmers are stupid enough to leave them out. I mean, the foxes only eat lambs if they're dead or they have to be from where they've just been born. Claire. Miss Forbes. Right, I'd like to say in support of fox hunting, what a jolly good tradition it is. <laughs> Getting up early in the morning, going out to the stables with a nice red jacket on. been a tradition in this country for hundreds of years. It's a social event. The whole family can take part. We know what a sly, cunning thief those foxes can be. We know the ravage that they can commit on hen houses, on guinea fowl. We've seen it. Um, um, there's lots of need to get rid of them. You wouldn't say that about dogs or cats or any of the domestic pets that people have at home. There's no comparison. There is a comparison because we've got... <laughs> Shut up. There are, there are um, lots of foxes and they should live, not, not just like... Um, you don't kill dogs just because there are lots of them and we don't like them. They're pests just because they do their toilet in the house and not outside. <laughs> so why should we kill the foxes? I fail, I fail to see the logic in your argument, Miss Tom Chick. Okay, then. So you that it's been going on for centuries. Well, you know, why don't it, it's time that the history changes then, isn't it? Yes, things do change the time. Now, fox hunting has isn't the sole domain of the aristocracy. Anybody can join a fox hunter. We're always keen to welcome new members. You argue that the chase is all important. There are other ways of enjoying a ride without the unnecessary destruction of one of Britain's most popular and beautiful animals. Well, the fox enjoys being hunted. <laughs> 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 Which 
forces are unbalanced and why they are unbalanced, why you think. That's easy, it's a simple. Right. So if we have a...
Right, now then, let's settle down. Number five was... Number five, who asked number five? Was the, was the king above the law? Draw it on and write that out. What? Well, we can use that one or that one. That's the last one. That's sweet. Do the other one. And that way. Okay, but what picture? I'm using that picture or that picture. The other one. Any of us. Oh, that light is burning. Aim, where are you going? Aim, where are you going? Oh, Alright, then Sarah. Oh, I went. And you are. I happen. I get stram lessons instead. Yeah, but it's still French though, isn't it? Why are you for me? It's still French though, isn't it? No, because we're doing it in English. Ah. Oh, that's sick. I think. That is. Oh, stupid. I think I'm not sure. But if you're doing it in French, don't we won't get that. If you're doing it in French, what? We won't get that. Because nobody can speak French now. <laughs> Alright then. Oh, you're going to have Devonshire if you're using French, would they? What okay. is Devonshire going for anyway? What? Because she can sing. Because <laughs> she can sing. Mm. I'm going to kill them. Have you done it? Yeah, I think so. Oh, no, my okay. brother did, did I never. What did you let your brother do it for? Because I didn't want to do it. Oh, sick that is. And I, I couldn't got... draw it, so I never. Neither did I. I've got a picture tape magazine. I took. Yeah. Well, I never knew. He said he did.
Taisez-vous, s'il vous plaît. Jeudi 14 janvier. La date. Jeudi 14 janvier. Le titre aujourd'hui, les vêtements. Les 
chaussettes. Les chaussettes. Le pantalon. Merci. Au revoir. As there are two uh, different things here, yeah. I've got to do two different things with uh, from uh, year eight and year ten. So I need to set the work for year eight first. Second year. I'm going to ask you in about 10, 15 minutes to come here one by one and talk about yourselves. She do that, she be new pot, she sweet free, raiment bavard, she insert a in free, my sister pal Joanna. A mon frère par David. Ma matière préférée est l'éducation physique. J'aime des animaux et la musique. J'aime le groupe Take That. Au revoir. Très bien. Vous avez des questions à poser à Rebecca <rire> Moi j'ai une question. Tu es bavarde Oui. Beaucoup bavarde <rire> Oui. Oui. Bon. Et tes matières préférées Quelles sont tes matières préférées Ma matière préférée, l'éducation physique. L'éducation physique, oui. Tu as des frères Oui. Oui. Un frère, deux frères <coughs> Un frère. Un frère. Oui. Tu s'appelles comment Il s'appelle David. Merci. D'autres questions Tu habites Newport ou Cardiff Newport. Newport, oui. Une question Et toi, un frère et deux sœurs. Deux sœurs Non, une sœur. Une sœur, un frère et une sœur. Bien. Très bien, merci. Okay.